I'm Lieutenant Eric Daly from the 374th Civil Engineer Squadron. I'm here leading a team from Yokota Air Base to construct this facility behind me. I'm the officer in charge for a group of 21 people. Uh, so we knocked this project out of the park. There's a huge challenge building a school within a month in a language where we didn't know the country, we're not familiar with their construction methods, but we came together with the Thai Air Force. Both teams were flexible and we got this building up ahead of schedule, no issues, and it looks pretty good. So our experience with Cobra Gold overall has been uh, incredible. We've really enjoyed getting to do all this hands-on construction. It's great training for us, it's great training for the Thais, and we've especially enjoyed getting to forge those bonds and friendships, spending so much time with the Royal Thai Air Force and learning about the culture of Thailand. We got to go to several temples. Uh, we spoke to a lot of Buddhist monks. We went to a lot of uh, local ceremonies. The local community came out and gave us a lot of gifts, taught us about their culture, and the Thai Air Force showed us some of their favorite parts of Thailand. So um, even though the construction was amazing, we had fun and this footprint's going to stay here. Uh, we're going to take those memories and those friendships back with us. So the big thing we're going to take away from this experience is the training we had. Like We didn't just learn how to build a building, we learned how to build a building without all the tools we needed, without being able to run to a Home Depot or speak the language in the local area. So we got a lot of training value out of it as engineers and we also forged a lot of friendships with the Thai Air Force and we'll be able to stay in contact with them and continue those. In addition to just having a new building, I really hope that the students, the local community and the leaders in this area uh, remember the United States Air Force for the positive impact we had and the positive experiences they had with us. Um, so was, uh, one of our huge priorities is to project a positive image and um, kind of build our partnership in this area. And that's one of the things that I hope the local community remembers from us. I will say, uh, so our group from Yakota, this is our second year in a row doing Cobra Gold. Uh, last year in Cobra Gold 2019, we got paired up with the exact same group of uh, Royal Thai Air Force. So when we showed up on day one, it was almost like a reunion. There were a lot of familiar faces and everyone was uh, happy that we were doing it again together. So this year uh, was even easier because we already had a working relationship and we already were familiar with the way our different teams worked. The makeup of the U.S. team, is we had 20 personnel from the Civil Engineer Squadron at Yakota and then one medic who came with us from Med Group. And, uh, Everyone, of course, has their own specialties. We had electricians, we had pavements experts, structural experts, we even had plumbers out here. But everyone just kind of picked up a tool and helped out where they could. Um, even our, our medic, for example, he wasn't expected to do any construction, but he was a workhorse the entire time. So he really integrated and got the job done.